yo what's up good people my name is Amfren innocent this is my youtube channel i managed to get to the nairobi national park and of course the animal orphanage here in nairobi so i'll be walking around showing you the different animals within this orphanage and within this park just but to mention a few there are the big five and many different animals that are housed or caged here so i'll start be i'll start by the crane crane and the crane is known to be the national symbol for uganda it is in fact drawn on their flag the crane has got amazing features bright colors amazing colors on its body and of course there were two different species over here these are a different kind of crane inside the nairobi park we have the porcupine the porcupine is well known for having spines on its body that are used to protect or safeguard it from any external attack or danger that when provoked it uses the spines to protect it and of course i also managed to get to see the warthog warthog is known to be one of the ugliest animals here on earth warthog feeds on grass like any other animal or herbivore or even though it's known to be the wild pig warthog likes playing within mud or in mud and uh, one fun fact about the warthog is that uh, warthog can run very fast when it senses or it sees danger i also managed to get to see the lion and by the way lions inside this park are just so many we have the cubs over here and i was told that the cubs are spotted so that they have got spots on their body even though these spots do disappear upon maturity so i was told these are cubs even though they looked big but trust me they are cubs monkeys were all over trying to tease you know the lions or the cubs inside these cages and uh, i think monkeys are just mischief you know they are the closest animals to human beings so they have got a big brain we have one monkey over here that is caged it was feeding on food that was placed inside those you know uh, things that are inside that cage we also had another monkey and this and so many others and uh, we also had the antelopes antelopes these are what fills up the park in every park you walk in here in Kenya, you'll get to realize that there are so many antelopes. Antelopes can also run very fast when they see danger. And by the way, we also managed to get to see the hyena. Even though this hyena was very tired and sleeping, I only managed to capture it from that aspect. That is the hyena over there. I also managed to get to see the buffalo. Buffalo is so big, it is... Uh, it has a spiking resemblance to the domestic cow even though it's slightly bigger and it feeds on green pastures vegetables and any other green substance that are edible so that is the buffalo let me just try and zoom in so that you can get to see buffalo is so big they walk in in groups you know such so that they can defend themselves when they see danger that is the buffalo with the long horns protruding from its head and also i managed to see the cheetah one fun fact about the cheetah is that it has got black lines dropping from the eyes down to the mouth and that is what differentiates the cheetah from the leopard i managed to capture the leopard let me just show you this is the leopard over here even though it was sleepy all along so i didn't manage to capture it while standing this over here are just cheetahs. Cheetahs are well known for the for how fast they can run, and uh, they are slightly smaller, you know, compared to leopard. Many people have heard that puzzle to differentiate between the two. So those are cheetahs over there. We have the guinea fowl. Guinea fowl also have a spiking resemblance to the domestic chicken, even though they live in the wide or in the park in the wide yeah, that is so guys i i hope you liked this video if you did please make sure you do subscribe if you have not also don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and let me see you in the next video bye bye